Hey, we want to welcome everybody to the start of the 37th annual St. Jude Memphis to Peoria run. We appreciate you being here. We're so excited to be leaving the St. Jude office here in Peoria. We're heading down to Memphis. We have 199 runners heading to Memphis and 11 chefs. We have 50 people on the VIP bus, so we're really, really excited to take so many people. I think this is a record-breaking year for the St. Jude runners. We have over 3,500 participants who will be hitting the streets starting tomorrow. The Memphis to Peoria runners leave tomorrow at 11 a.m., and then all the other satellites will leave on Saturday and Sunday. So we're really thankful for your support. Keep donating. Keep spreading the word. This is a very pure mission, so we're really, really thankful for all of the, pure, uh, the support of Peoria and the surrounding communities. So thank you. My name is Tom Kahn. This will be my 16th year doing the Memphis Peoria run. And I run, friends of mine have lost children to cancer, and I'm very fortunate to have seven healthy grandchildren. I run for everybody. Just to tour the hospital and see the runners off from there and really excited about it. So uh, uh, Chief McCoy obviously uh, asked me to go and how can you tell him no? So this is a great uh, project and uh, keep giving money to the kids of St. Jude. Thanks. My name is Jeff Cruzen and I'm a member of the blue team in blue 12. And this is my seventh year running, seventh run. And uh, I run, I'm a teacher, and over the course of my years teaching, I've had a number of students uh, who have been patients. I've got one currently, so uh, that's the reason why I choose to run. Well, we're really excited here at the kickoff uh, of the 37th run. Uh, this is my 24th year doing, doing this when when I first started, my kids were six, five, and three. And so it's kind of special today to see all these young kids uh, here at the send off and all the family members. People forget that when the runners take off and go to Memphis and back, there are the family members here that are keeping things going while they're gone. So it's really important part of this morning ceremony is not just to send the runners off, but also to, to uh, pray around and, and keep the families that are here in mind as well. I'm Dave Vopel. I'm one of the chefs for the Memphis to Peoria run. I do this um, simply because I'm too old and I'm too fat to run, but I want to help in some way. Uh, feeding the runners is a fantastic, it's a great group, and we have such a good time doing it. Uh, it's just an honor to be a part of this. So we really appreciate all the runners, love what they're doing. I can't do it, but this is one thing I can do to help them. My name is soon to be Kim Pillman. And my name is Rich Pillman. We're getting married this Saturday and uh, we're going to be on the run for our honeymoon this year on Tuesday. And this will be my 17th year running the Memphis to Peoria run. And I run in the memory of a good friend of mine who lost his battle with cancer at the age of 13. His name was Brian Rosecrans. And uh, we tribute the run and the money we raise for him and other kids of St. Jude. And this is my second year on the run, and Rich got me started last year doing it. And I just, I run for all of the kids of St. Jude. And the experience I had last year is absolutely amazing. I can't even explain how awesome it is. So I'm really excited to be here for my second year, and we get to do it together. Yeah, as um, newlyweds. As newlyweds. And we just want to thank everybody that donates money to St. Jude. It's a great cause. We could not do the run without all of you that help us raise the funds to uh, support St. Jude. So thank you for doing that. Hi, my name is Brenda Shago, and this will be my 10th year running Memphis, which is quite a feat for me. I started out running the Canton Run and I never thought in a million years I'd be able to do the Memphis run, but here I am today, 10 years later, and the reason I run is for a little boy in my neighborhood, Kyle, who was diagnosed twice, beat it twice, and was a recent high school graduate, and that just shows what St. Jude does. It helps save lives. Thank you.
Uh, my name is Josh Malavolti. Um, I am actually in Blue 7, and then this is my 16th year uh, on the St. Jude run. Um, the reason why I do the run is to uh, remember my friends that I lost and to give back to the place that uh, saved my life. So I am a 16-year cancer survivor this year. My name's Terry Cooper. I run for the blue team. I'm in blue seven. And uh, I started the run 15 years ago. Um, my mom's favorite charity was St. Jude. So uh, I wanted to start doing the run for her. And uh, she's no longer with us, so you know she's still with me when uh, you know in here. So that's that's why I do the run now for St. Jude. My name is Irene Zercher. This is my tenth year on the St. Jude Memphis to Peoria run. My husband Phil and I have been on the support team as chefs. We've really enjoyed the opportunity to give back to St. Jude, help our community. We are very blessed to have eight healthy grandchildren. And that's the reason we do this, to support such a wonderful organization as St. Jude and what they give back to our children, keep them healthy, and we just really enjoy this. We have a great group of chefs, and let me tell you, we have too much fun. Thank you again. Good morning, my name is Julie Whitty, and I'm the Regional Executive Director here for ALSAC St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. Today we're seeing off over 200 Memphis to Peoria runners They've worked tirelessly for months raising funds to support the mission of St. Jude. There's no place like St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. We are leading the way the world understands, treats, and defeats childhood cancer and other deadly diseases. So we are so excited to thank all of these wonderful supporters. And you can get involved too. We have runs throughout the entire region, satellite runs, support a runner, visit our website. We've got a wonderful telethon on Saturday. So call in a donation to help the greatest, most worthy mission ever.